Nollywood actor come Labour Party chieftain Kenneth Okonkwo has alleged that the ruling All Progressive Congress APC is responsible for the propaganda about a retired colonel Chinyere will be shot by talks during the 2023 election. Nigeria News earlier reported that Chinyere, in an interview with Punch, narrated how suspected political talks shot her during the election. According to her, the incident was reported to the Imo State Criminal Investigation Department and the suspect was arrested but later released. Hence, she petitioned the AIG at Omaha Police Headquarters, Zone 9, speaking about the sacrifices she made for the party during the campaign. The retired colonel said she sold all her properties, bought food items, bags, and made customized shirts which were distributed. Chinyere claimed that neither Peter Obi nor the Labour Party National Chairman Julius Aburi should concern for her ordeal as they allegedly abandoned her. In a statement via Twitter on Saturday, Kenneth Okonkwo said Chinyere was with Labour Party supporters in Abuja earlier this month, July, during an event organized to mark the birthday of Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi. The thespian said the retired colonel also restated her love for the quest for a new Nigeria. He added that attempts by the APC to dissuade Chinyere from her principled stand for Peter B had failed. Hence, the reason for the blackmail and propaganda. He wrote, I was with my sister and our veteran distinguished military officer, Colonel Chinyere, who be retired at the Merit House Abuja on the 19th of July. 2023 at an obedience movement organized event to mark the birthday party of peter b where we talked over some communication missed up when some hired hoodlums shot her for defending the votes for a new nigeria and she recited her love for the request or for the quest of a new nigeria championed by peter b all attempts by the agents of the failed ruling party to dissuade her from our principled stand for a new Nigeria field. Hence, they are resort to unending blackmail using our image for their unfounded propaganda. We love you, Kone Obi, see tomorrow. No, the question is that who has been speaking? She has, this is the second time because I'm surprised. That's why I said in July 2023 because it was last month or so, the first art burst came from her and again second has bought had boss this uh, month again so if she made mention of what she said in june and in july she was with a uh, peter b or she was at the event organized by other people for peter b say birthday so why this because to me you have not really explained kenneth has not really explained what happened does it mean the apc are the ones speaking why is it that she has not come out to debunk that because of course you can tell me that uh, whether the talks or whosoever that shot her of course they are going to be apc ways and the person was released after since uh, you said the matter was reported to the aig so why is she making all of those statements because as far as i know she's not the only person who spent for this uh, movement the question is that did you people saw her did you visit her that is the another question but in my opinion the woman has not really acted you know uh, wisely but that does not take the fathers did you people visit her of course we cannot visit everybody but if uh, some people were in the area because the matter did not even we didn't hear about the matter whether she was shot or not not until when she came out and started making this a uh, allegation hmm. Well, please, please help her with money and please stop story. We love you, Ubi. God bless Ubi. We know their answers. It is too early to complain. Don't you know they are still on legal hmm, battle to regain their mandate? She's an agent of APC. Don't mind her. You Have you ever seen that kind of uh, eyeglasses? <laughs> My brother, please use your good time for something else. Please note. Not for this woman talking nonsense with her mouth. She has collected little money from the opponents. If she actually attended 
the birthday of the Labour Party candidate, then why this propaganda? That's my question. But Sakele Tukoko is a highly honest and truthful person. I wish sure that Colonel Chinyere did not discuss her plight during the very recent events at Abuja. I believe that her attitude is blackmailed. This is not expected from a member who has invested so much in the obedience movement as she claims to have done. It is possible that detractors are using her image to do the blackmail and media propaganda issue. She should make to refuse sim publicly. Exactly. You see, apart from this guy, Okonkwo, abnormal big man and facial look, so he also has a dementia disease and lack a, of cognitive abilities, which is very tantamount to loss of memory. He is, f- uh, is a fool, or to the extent that uh, he has never seen anything good in his follow fellow human being. Please, how can a normal being be accusing only APC for shooting that woman in an action that about 40 political parties took part on? As we can see, this madman is talking out of sense. Hmm. You will go in vain. If you notice all the people that are responding negatively to the comments are Yorubas, tribalism never tire Una. We know send Una. We are lovers of good things across the border. Hope you guys are buying for 120 naira per litre in your APC filling station. Hmm. If this woman did what she claimed she did for Obi to win and she truly believes in obedience movements and obese capability, why is she crying for recognition and a refund or reward? Woman, you are Yahoo. You thought Obi will win. Your song would have been different. Sending receipt for what? Obi send you message. Thank you very much, sir, for the clarification. We know that there's nothing that APC, the agent of darkness and source of fake items, cannot do to tarnish the image of the chosen one, His Excellency Peter B. Where Kenneth Okonko, popularly known as Andy, has said it all, there was no need asking the woman how and what she did, and she did it for. Andy has said it all. Kenneth Okonko, you are very correct. These people have been drowned. And that is why they have resorted to all manner of uh, most lying in and cheap black meat. Nigerians are now wise and want nothing else but a new Nigeria. A new Nigeria.